buddy. Come on, guys. Come on, right, let's man. go. Let's go. Keep it up. I'm going to push you down these stairs. Vegas, get him. Watch out. Watch out. I got a man in a chair. All right, everybody, come on. Break it up. Let's go. Do you understand what probation means? Uh, yes, sir. It means that if you continue down that same path, you'll be locked up and calling some cellmate daddy within a month. Yes, sir. If I had it my way, we wouldn't waste our time. You'd be inside already. Mr. Gray has made great progress. His share on willfulness was one of the most powerful things I've ever heard. I, I believe in this man. Let's hope you don't live to regret that faith. God works in mysterious ways. <laughs> in this case, seems God is downright perverse. But I'll leave the salvation to you gentlemen. You stay out of trouble. Yes, Daddy. Excuse me? Yes, sir. Billy, remember, it's a disease. I know, Chad, I know. It's a disease. Meetings every day. Call you if I feel the need to use. Pray. I pray. In fact, I'm praying right now. You're very willful. Was very willful, Chad. Was very willful. I've changed. And you know what, Chad? You changed me. Gentlemen, shall we get the fuck out of here? Hey, stay in touch. Yo. Here you go. It's about time. Home sweet home. <laughs> Okay, another round for you. Goddamn bike. Yeah. Yummy. So, Johnny boy, where's my bike? You know where it is. Let me rephrase the question. Where the fuck is my bike and where the fuck haven't you got it back for me? Because you know where it is. Are you deaf? Give me that whiskey. 
Are you fucking deaf? No. Then answer the goddamn question. Why the fuck haven't you got it back for me, friend brother? One word. Business. Like I told you when you were in there. Or were you so busy playing holier than thou, you started believing your own bullshit? Oh, forgive me. You know, I've had a complicated few weeks. I can only imagine. Though. Shut up, man. You know, coming off heroin's kind of hard. I think I acquired this touch of amnesia. What business is more important, Mr. 1980s yuppie big shot, than your best friend's bike when he's close to getting a 15-year stretch? The business that pays his lawyer's fees. The business that puts food on all of our tables. The business that we are all in while you're out pretending to be saved. Get my bike! What am I, your fucking dog? I told you you should have gotten bike. You told me? You told me you don't tell me shit, you little fuck! Listen, Billy. They were pissed, and they had a reason. Your bike chopped that girl's leg off. You put Joe John's nephew in a coma. The deadbeats kept the bike, and we needed the money. You needed some balls. Ugh. Some fucking heart. Something. I can't believe I'm hearing this shit. And I can't believe I'm hearing this. After everything we did for you, paid your rehab, paid your lawyer's fees, paid your rent, Paid everything. Shit, we set stuff up for you. We do well, man, but it's time to be smart. You're right, you're right. No, you're right. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna run right out and buy a condo, get a mortgage, 401k, then fold that over into an IRA and a CD. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck, man? Be smart? You be smart, you fucking chump. You're ridiculous. Have you got a health care plan? Come on, Johnny. Let's just get his bike. Come on. Well, on your head be it. It always is. It's called leadership. Shit meaning something. Yeah, and your shit means a lot, man. Come on. The roots of death Johnny! Are on. Yeah? Wait, come here. LCHC. Listen, man. Well, pin up right now. You saw that shit I had to go through, right? It was really frustrating. Fucked up shit. Craziness, right? Okay, so I'm a little pissed off and I've been a bit of a prick lately. Come on, man. You and Angus built that bike for me? That's gotta stand for something. Yeah, you're right, brother. I'm gonna go get it. And you know what? Peace and prosperity be damned. Peace and prosperity be damned, my brother. You are my brother, Johnny. Always. Let's go! Brothers, come on in. Gather around. Hey. Chill out. Brothers. I just got word that Jason's been killed up and broken. Oh, he was banging some Russian broad and her heavy-duty father didn't much like it. And hired a fucking Polak to do it. I think he was a Serb, Brian. Fucking Slav scumbag all the fuck Shut the fuck up. Brothers, we will find a way to get payback against this Polish, Russian, Serb, I don't really give a shit. In the meantime, let's take a moment to remember Jason and all the other men who've given the finger to this shitty little thing that we call conformity. Hey Amen, Billy. Got that right. Now Jason was he's just a kid, but he hit the throttle harder than most of us, huh? He's a lawbreaker, troublemaker, beer drinker, and hell raiser. Uh, he didn't suffer fools. Got any piece of hole he wanted. <laughs> Always had time for a brother in need, and he was scared of precisely jack shit. That's right. <laughs> in short, the kind of man I'd want to be. Jason Michaels. Lost, but not forgotten. Amen to that, buddy. Jason. Ah. <sighs> Okay, boys. The time for pussy licking and ass kissing is over. We are brothers for life, lost forever. In these perilous times, it's more important than ever that you follow your leader, and that is me. Remember. Yeah. See you boys back at the clubhouse. So where did you get them from? Oh, you know, from a little contact I have, I really want you to cut me out of the loop. The hell I get it. What is wrong with you? Hey, man, what kind of shit is out there? Billy, all you gotta do is grab it. 
And that makes you what? A uh, shit grabber? <laughs> shit grabber. Wow. Now, see, I like how you did that. It was very good, very clever. Almost like a joke, you know, only it wasn't funny. Johnny, you met Ray? Hey. Ray Botino? Hey. My brother, Johnny. Johnny the Jew. Johnny the Jew, how the hell are you? Do me a favor, help keep this degenerate out of jail, all right? At least until he's paid me. I'll do my best. Yeah, later. What's he selling you? Toys, my boy, toys. <sighs> now, come on, let's go. Man, where are we going, Bill? Pay somebody a visit. Billy, man, please don't be a dick. Johnny, you seem a little tense lately. Have you considered some analysis? Maybe a day spa? <laughs> High colonic? Colonic. <laughs> I just don't see how we have a choice, man. I have a choice. I'm free. I'm not a slave. I have a choice. Jim, I love you, man, but since you've hit middle age, you really lost something. Yeah, and since you've fucking been strung out on this shit, you've lost something. You fucking mind. Easy, Jim. Look who the fuck you're speaking to, huh? Hey. What's up? I'm just trying to explain to our friend here that possession is nine-tenths of the law. We should make the slopes pay us back. Billy, I got Chad on the phone. Pay us back for what? Look, we have a business opportunity here, Johnny. You think a guy like you should be pleased? Yeah, but Jim says there's some problem. There is. That H we stole. It belonged to the Chinese. The deadbeats told them we got it and they want it back. So? Fuck them. Finally! Billy, Chad's on the phone about the meeting. Look, normally I'd be down for that, but these aren't the type of dudes you just say fuck them to. There's some heavily armed, pissed off motherfuckers who killed a couple of angels when they found out this shit was gone. Now I'm thinking maybe we could strike up a deal. Okay. Okay. Yeah, why don't you just suck them off while you're at it? <laughs> and tell Chad I'm sober as can be over here! That's what I told Look, him. I just think that given this war we're back into with the Angels of Death, and given the fact that one or possibly two government agencies are looking into our shit, that offloading the heroin would be a good idea, all right? And looking for a fight is the wrong thing to do right now, given the fact that we can't even stop fighting amongst ourselves. Yeah, you're right. We should probably all get in a circle, hold hands, pray, sing kumbaya. Kumbaya. <laughs> yeah, whatever. <laughs> this ain't no joking matter, Billy. We'll either end up dead in the ground or back in the lockup with you. I ain't going back there. I'd rather be dead. Well, you don't have to do either, man. I just think that getting rid of that stuff now is the right thing to do. Okay. Hey, here comes the big man. Gentlemen. Hey. Chad and Johnny. Hey, my brother. Hey, what's the plan? We spoke to that fat fuck Brian. He wants to sit down and call a truce. <laughs> Brian wants a truce? Yeah. Fuck that. Let's go get him. That's what I thought you'd All say. Right, let's do it. Even dead reeds go over the sacred. Come on, man. We can't let these pricks get away. Let's just go. Looks like we're about all that's left of the Alderney chapter, man. We don't need numbers, man. We need brothers. And that's what we got left. You, me, Angus, Terry, Clay, brothers. You're right about that. Shit. I wish we pinned down Brian, that little weasel. He'll turn up soon enough. Yeah, maybe. See you soon, brother. Gentlemen. Johnny, you remember Ray, right? Yeah, how you doing? How am I doing? I got the feds all over me. I got a boss who's a paranoid wreck, and I got a guy above me in the food chain with a brain like an overcooked artie joke. <laughs> Things are great. Yeah? Sounds like shit to me, but whatever. So, uh, why are you here? I heard you boys is having a little internal dispute. And yeah, where'd you hear that from? From Ashley. You friends with Ashley? <laughs> Everybody's friends with Ashley, tough guy. <laughs> Ah, uh, you know, she's a good kid and all. A little messed up, but, you know, she needed a friend. Ray told us where Brian is. Yeah. Oh, yeah, where? And how the hell does he know? All right, 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 right. Don't go breaking my balls, all right? I talked to Brian a half an hour ago. And listen, I understand where you guys are coming from. And on one hand, I don't give a shit. A bunch of grease monkeys want to have an all-out gangbang being my guest. You're all adults. Sort of. <laughs> but right now, I need calm. Billy's on the inside. I need a steady flow of merchandise. So it's in my interest to see that you boys calm things down. End this little squabble and get back to work. I'll see you later. Yeah, see you later, yeah, Ray. Bye, buddy. 
So what do you think, Johnny? I think that guy makes my skin crawl. But now that you mention it, so does Brian. And right now, he's our problem. God damn it! Brian was my brother! Yeah, he was. But so were a lot of people. I don't feel like that shit means too much anymore. So? So I'm gonna go pay Brian a visit. And see just what that fat fucker's problem is. See you all later. Johnny. Hey. Hey. We had fun here. <laughs> yeah, we did. But it's over. Yeah, it is. How the fuck did that happen? You know how it happens. It's that fucked up part of people, which means good is never good enough. I mean, it wasn't enough we had to be drug dealers. We also had to be outlaws, to be maniacs, to be psychos, and to be greedy. You know. Well, that combination of greed and fucked up stupidity, that works well. In the government, not so good if you're a fucking crook. Huh. <laughs> Ain't that the truth. Go ahead. Let's put this place out of its misery. Yeah, do what you gotta do. Come on, man, let's get out of here. You seen Ashley? Johnny's looking for her. Well, you know, as a matter of fact, I just did, just ten minutes ago. Yeah, I saw her on the end of this penis here. Uh, Johnny ain't gonna be cool if you mess him with her again. Oh, really? Well, you don't think so, huh? Well, why don't we just ask him then, huh? Hey, hey, cowboy! You mind that I fucked your old lady? Sorry! What was that? Well, no, 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 you don't mind? Oh, because you're a dead man? And the only sentient party you left is this little bit of brain and the gristle on the end of my boot? Well, thank you very much, cowboy! Bullshit! Oh, I like it! Denial! That is first part of the grieving process, brothers. Now let's all hold hands, huh? Well, looks like you got something you want to say, huh? You got something you need to say? This better be bullshit! Oh, well, where are you guys going, huh? Let's go, ladies! <laughs> 